Job chapter 2. Job chapter 2 and uh, verse 13. And the Jews' Passover was at hand, and Jesus went up to Jerusalem and found in the temple those that sold oxen and sheep and doves, and the changers of money sitting, and when he had made a scourge of small cords, in other words, when he had made a whip, he drove them uh, all out of the temple and the sheep and the oxen, and poured out the changers' money and overthrew the tables, and said unto them that sold doves, Take these things hence, make not my father's house an house of merchandise. In other words, they were setting things in the, in the house of God, in the temple. And so this was, this was a no-no. This was not right in the sight of the Lord. And the Lord was actually angry concerning things. And this is what we call righteous anger. Anger is not always wrong. There is a place for anger. Righteous anger is okay. But unrighteous anger obviously isn't okay. And so we need to understand, when we look at the Lord Jesus Christ, we see him absolutely righteous in his judgment. You see, we live in this country and all over the world, we have uh, unrighteous judgment. The laws of, you know, the uh, judicial system of this land down under and all over the world, it's corrupt. And if you've got enough money, you can get away with murder. You know that. If you've got enough money, you can bribe the judge. But you know something? We cannot bribe God. God will never ever be bribed. And we need to understand we have a sin debt that we cannot pay. And that payment can only be made by the Lord Jesus Christ. And he's paid in full with his own precious blood upon the cross of Calvary, being crucified for you and for me. Christ died for our sins, according to the scriptures, and he was paid.
Thank you. 